The biggest game of the week was a Thursday night thriller which featured the best ACC teams as the second-ranked Boston College Eagles face the eighth-ranked Virginia Tech Hokies. They are tied at zeros in the second quarter when Eddie Crown Royal makes a ridiculous catch, stays in bounds for the eight-yard touchdown reception to put the Hokies up 7-0. We move all the way to the fourth quarter. A little over two minutes left in the game. Score 10-0 Hokies when BC's Matt Ryan tosses a BEA beautiful pass to Ridge Gunnell for the 16-yard touchdown. After Boston College recovers the onside kick, it's third and 20, and on the 20, on text 24, Matt Ryan likes his eggs scrambled as he does just that and throws another perfect pass to Andre Callender for the 24-yard touchdown to give Boston College a victory 14-10. to The Pac-10 has two teams ranked in the top five. One is the fifth-ranked Oregon Ducks, which faced the 12th-ranked USC Trojans. Oregon's phone was blowing up as they answered the wake-up call and answered USC's touchdown with one of their own, thanks to a great 16-yard touchdown run by Jonathan Stewart to put the Ducks up by seven. Same score when Stewart gets the finish him as he runs another touchdown in to put Oregon up 14, and that's all they needed as they went 24 to 17. The other Pac-10 team is the undefeated fourth-ranked Arizona State Sun Devils who took on the 21-ranked California Golden Bears. Cal now up 13 in the second quarter when Demetrius Nance runs for fun for an 11-yard touchdown that brings the Southern Devils within the six. We move to the third quarter, score 20 to 14 in favor of the Bears when Demetri Nance will not be denied as he scores his third touchdown of the day. He puts the Sun Devils up one and they go on to win 31 to 21 to remain undefeated on the season. The Sun Devils will face Oregon next week to prove who is the best of the best in the Pac-10. Here's a look at this week's key upsets. The 23rd ranked UConn Huskies handed the 10th ranked South Florida Bulls its second straight loss. And NC State had its best win of the year as they beat the 15th ranked Virginia Cavaliers. I'm Mark Kaplan and that was a rundown.